Okay, welcome back, everybody. Um, I just realized that there's another 1980s movie I want to review right after this one. But I have to tell you, this movie that I'm going to review now is just, it's, it's funny and it's corny uh, and it's got one of my one of my favorite uh, other favorite female actresses in it and it's got some folks in it that just together they are just truly comical and one of the people that I haven't seen it, it's also got a former MTV VJ in it the lady and this movie is truly comical it's this earth girls are easy this movie it's you know of course got Gina Davis Jim Carrey Damon Winans Jeff Goldblum and of course Julie Brown we're talking about the the white Julie Brown not the african-american one uh, and oh my gosh this movie is just is unusual I mean it it is just it's funny and, and this is also goes back to what I was talking about previously with like Bill Cosby himself you know you don't have to be gross or perverted to be funny this movie is funny just because it's you know like that kind of humor that it's you know like insinuated and it's you know cleaner because it's you know not like you know f this f that type comedy uh, and it is you know very very just unusual and it's actually um and i have to mention this radio guy i don't know if he's still on the air or not because i've never heard him but i happen to have a disc of his it's a uh, dr demento Julie Brown, that's in this movie, sang a song called "Because I'm Blonde" or "Because I'm a Blonde," and it actually got played in this movie, and then it got played on Dr. Demento's show. And this was actually even written by Julie Brown and then Charlie Coffee and Terrence McNally. But this was, oh goodness, this was done back in, like I said, 1988. So, I mean, this is, you know, you can tell this is an 80s flick. And it is just, oh my god. It is funny. I mean, like in a strange sort of way. And, and you have to know, anything with a Winans brother and it's bound to be funny. And Jim Carrey's in this movie, too. Um, this was, of course, before he got all big and famous and Damon Winans, too. You know, but I do recommend this movie if you want to see what the both of them were like well before they became famous in a movie. It's just, it's funny. Jeff Goldblum's pretty decent in this movie, too. Although, I know he's, you know, like, he. it's like the Three Stooges from, like, a foreign planet or a distant planet. So, it is very, very funny. Anyway, I've got one more movie to review, and then, you know, we'll get talking about some other stuff for the time being, okay? So hang on, let me go get the other movie, and I'll be right back, okay? Okay.